everybody, welcome back. How are you all doing? Good, I hope. We are doing marvelous so far. <clears throat> so far, I have a haul for you. It's kind of a combined fall and miscellaneous stuff. So I went to Dollar Tree and my local family dollar. So we are going to show you what I got. So hope you like it and hopefully you've enjoyed the video so far for the October the getting ready for fall kind of stuff and I'm saving a lot of it for uh, obviously for October. So but I'm going to throw in some other stuff too. So okay, so from Dollar Tree is kind of a mixture of fall and Halloween and um, Ariel's birthday. So she likes, she's on this kick with tigers. So the orange and black. So I'm trying to find, you can't find other than online tiger stuff. So I'm kind of doing here and there. I mean, she's going to be 13. I don't want to spend buku bucks on party stuff or whatever. So I did find these two little bags. You get two of them for a buck. So for her birthday presents, she usually has, we usually take her out to eat or something for her birthday, but I do get her a couple of things because her birthday's October and then Christmas is not too far away. So usually I'll, I'll get her like one or two things for her birthday and then the rest of it is Christmas. But she ha usually has a birthday party and her birthday party, she's kind of popular. <laughs> I never had that many kids at my birthday. She's She's got anywhere from 20 to 30 kids that usually show up. So she gets a lot of presents. So I'm not going to go all out for her birthday where she's going to get a ton of stuff from everybody else. And this year's kind of a big year. She's turning 13. She's officially a teenager and all that kind of stuff. So I did grab some of these. What else did I get? I found orange balloons because I figured we could blow them up and put little black tiger marks on them or whatever. They wanted seven bucks for a package of seven balloons at Party City or something like that. Fifteen for a buck. <laughs> no, I'll, I'll, a black marker. Yeah, okay. And then she wanted tiger invitations, but... I said they didn't have those, but they do. They did have these black ones with the different designs on the candles. I said, eh, that'll work. So she's thinking right now on her paper that she gave me, she has eight kids on there. And she's probably going to invite a little more than that. So I got two packages, so she'll have enough. And then these are cool. They're not tiger related, but they're like really neat. There are these like tie-dyed. So I thought that would be cool. So I got her those. What else can I get her? Oh, I got, I have the three over there already. I needed a one for 13. So we got that. What else did I get her for her birthday? Um, I think there's some. No, that's it. That's it. And she does watch my videos, so I can't show you what I've gotten her so far. So I can't show you. But it's cute. There's a couple of Halloween-related kind of things because her birthday is before Halloween, and I thought these would be cute. So whatever, you know. Okay. This I got at Dollar Tree. It was still on Dollar Tree. This I didn't get just for this. Now, oh, I can't remember her name. Crap. Country. Oh, with Tracy. Charm. Country Charm with Tracy or something like that. Anyway, she has um, some tutorials on her site. Let me move this out of the way. That she did with... these with the trucks with these trucks and she cut off this part and then 
made it so it looked like she glued this in between this little box in between obviously she painted it but it was like like this so this part wasn't on here you just saw this part so it's like 3d kind of and I bought these last year because I wanted to I saw her um, how-to thing last year but I couldn't find these so I actually there were three of these left and I, I only need one because I only got these so I can't mess them up but she has a she has what's it called the boo crew um, a Christmas card mail thing and then she had a fall like this a fall one and I wanted to do the Christmas one so I'm gonna rewatch her video and I want to do the Christmas one so yeah these ones this year are different they don't look like this at all they're totally different so I wanted to do that for December and it it holds Christmas cards now I don't know this maybe she got a bigger box I don't think Christmas cards are gonna fit in this this is kind of teeny this is um, uh, it doesn't say how big it is but I don't, I don't think it'll hold I mean if the card is like this size it will but if it's I don't have a card a card well most cards about the size of a piece of paper so it'll fit inside you know kitty corner so but I want to do that so that's why I got this is so I can do this project so I got that one. Let me hang this back up. I thought I bought four of these last year, but I guess not. So I, I only want one. And so, um, thinking of Christmas, <laughs> I grabbed tape. Since I was thinking about Christmas, I grabbed tape. And I'll put that over in my, I have a wrapping um, tin that popcorn used to come in. You know, that popcorn comes in. It's of Santa and stuff. Well, that tin houses my pens, my scissors, and tape for wrap for Christmas. Excuse me. And I'll put it in. That way it's hid, and Ariel can't find it. I grabbed a kitty collar because uh, Daisy has ruined hers like this, and these are only a dollar. And I got her the same one because Ariel like it's her cat and she likes this color. Some more, excuse me, glue sticks. Um, I noticed over in my bin over here, I didn't have that many little ones left. All right, and I grab our hot cocoa bar that we're going to do. I thought it would be fun to put some little candies. I, I got that skeleton bowl with the hands on it like this. I thought I would grab a couple of candies. This one is like sweet tarts and she likes sweet tarts. This is like the ring and the necklace and stuff. And then she loves these um, Tootsie Roll fruit chews. I do too. I like the cherry one. And I grabbed some of those to put in there and some soft cherry um, sweet tart things. So I figured I'd get that to put in there. And then uh, it was on a Facebook group, a Halloween Facebook group. I can't remember which one. Anyway, these women got together to have a craft night and they each decorated. I couldn't find the boo. I wish they had the boo, but they didn't have the boo. But they did have eek. So there's an E, E, K, and then an explanation point. And how they decorated them was so pretty. And I'm like, well, if I can find one, I'll grab it. And if I find Boo too, I will grab it. So I don't know if this will be a project this year, maybe next year. But I will write down some notes on how they decorated theirs because it's really pretty. They did one that was like really vibrant colors, and I really like that. So, and that might be our theme next year, is more vibrant 
you know, more the kitty, cartoony kind of thing. Because the last couple of years I've been kind of creepy, you know. But I may save this for next year. I don't know. But we're going to hang it on my thing over here. The things that I get that hang, I have this um, right here. It's actually supposed to go in the front here. So when I do a how-to, I can use my camera and put it in there so it's down so you can see what's going on. But it's a pain in the neck to set up. <clears throat> so I just leave it there and hang this stuff up. Okay, the next miscellaneous thing is I love the country farmhouse. And my dollar, family dollar, this is family dollar now. They, I was walking by the aisle and I, this caught my eye because I saw the red, they had a red and black one. And everything else upstairs for me is this. And these are the things that you put on your counter when you wash your dishes or whatever. And it has two of them. So a two of them for five bucks. The one I have up there now is the black and white, um, like, Paris kind of thing. It has the de fleur uh, all over it. So now I can take that off and have this match everything else. And I thought this would be cool. And depending on the size of this, I could put this in front of the sink for a little mat. I have a black rug there right now. But I got this. So I will put that away. I did grab, I keep all the kids' candles. Now I probably have a number one and I probably have a three that I can reuse, but I, since she's turning a teenager, I would grab new ones. So I got 13, one and a three for her. So I'll take this stuff upstairs. And I had to get my doggies some treats. A little while, I got two of these, these were a buck and they love these things. Probably not good for them. It says munchy sticks, chicken flavored, low fat, high protein, no um, corn, soy, or wheat, no artificial flavors, colors or flavors. Ooh, they're like these. Um, recommended three pieces per day. They don't even get that. They get like one in the morning. <laughs> so that's cool. So I got this. So that will go upstairs. Put this back in the bag. So that'll go upstairs with that Halloween candy. And then lastly, I got this for the planner, my October. Um, I call it my yearly planner, but for the year, you know, the school year. And that's the one I write everything in other than bills and my business stuff. So I thought for October, I've already decorated one page, but this would be fun to do a couple other pages. And then it says Happy Halloween on the back side. How many are in here? 12 sheets. I may go back and get some more of these for like a little goodie bag for her friends. I mean, they're, they're teenagers now, so what do you get for a goodie bag? You give them snacks. <laughs> so I thought maybe I would get like a case of like orange soda or ginger ale or whatever and a bag of candy bars and these cute little stickers you know and give them that for a goodie bag this year so that's what i thought i'd do but i'm going to keep that for me and then i grabbed some of this makeup crayons we just had homecoming and ariel was actually in the homecoming um uh float thing for the junior high and all the kids, our, our school is Millard, and it's blue, blue and white. And all the kids had an M, blue M. She goes, Mom, I wish I had a thing to do that. And I'm like, she goes, I have eyeshadow. I said, yeah, but it wouldn't show up. So I grabbed one of these that has the blue crayon in it so she can use that. It's not very big. I probably should have grabbed a couple of these. They're only a dollar. But I grabbed it for the blue one so she could do the M next time. Or if they're having a spirit week, she could do that. Now these look like bullets to me, don't they? Don't they look like bullets? <laughs> so I might grab another one of these too. 
I was going to shower those. And then what I got is a bunch of these. I grabbed every one that they had. So they had the pumpkin. They had the witch hat. They had the ghost. And they had the kitty. Now I thought this would be a good um, party favor too. Is that they can go home and paint it themselves or whatever. So depending on how many of our friends are coming. Because there's eight in each one of these. And I want to keep one of each. So we'll like put this in a goodie bag. We'll get uh, a thing of soda of some kind. Soda. And then... Um, some a bag of candy bars so since they're out right now it'd be easy to get and maybe another one of these so they'll each get a sticker in this little crafty thing they can take home and paint or whatever so that's what i decided to do for her i haven't told her yet so that is everything that i got um yeah so there's going to be this is probably going to be a december project so We'll have to wait and see how that happens. So, I will see you in a bit. Thanks for watching.